Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 27th of February 2025. I hope you are keeping well and everybody is in good health as best as they can be. What's going on in the world? Uh, human hard-boiled egg uh, whose shell, if you could crack it open, would reveal uh, an inedible dry and crumbly brain. Uh, that's Jeff Bezos has decided that the uh, Washington Post will have his opinion uh, and that's about it uh, and not many others um, <laughs> uh, in 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 uh, along the lines of uh, Rupert Murdoch who always insists that his editors post his opinions basically uh, and has always done that since he began in the newspaper industry um, Jeff Bezos has now said uh, opinions will be about free freedom, free enter free enterprise or something like that. I did read I did read it. It was awful, goddamn statement. Uh, but basically, you know, oh free the, the free market. I think that's what it was about. There we are. That's his opinion about free market. Must be about free market. And of course, we know uh, we've seen what's happened recently. Many people have resigned from the Washington Post over his uh, first of all over his uh, refusal to. Um, support Cam Kamala Harris, or, and then recent, more recently with uh, policy decisions that have been made. Anyway, so uh, that's the uh, death of the uh, democracy dies in darkness. No, democracy dies when Jeff Bezos, when billionaires take over. That's when democracy dies. Okay, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? This is the New York Times hard level Sudoku puzzle. We've got eight and two blocking down here. I can see that immediately we're going to get eight and two in those squares. We can do better. We've got two blocking there. So we've got two in that square. We've got eight in that square. That's a nice beginning. <coughs> Excuse me. And then we'll take the twos northward and get ourselves a two up there. Hmm. We'll keep going with twos because I like the twos. They look nice. Two blocking across, like as you can see, that means two must be in one of these squares blocking up. That's going to give me a two there. We've got twos in those squares, so I can see something immediately. We're going to have two in one of these two squares, right? If you see this kind of pattern, we've got twos blocking like this, so we've got twos there down here. Twos are limited to middle column, right column. So in this shoot, we can only look for two in these two squares. Unfortunately for us, we've got a blocking one there. So that means that will be a two there, two across that way, two across that way, two up here. There is a two. Uh, any more spaces we can get to? No, of course not, because we've got our remainder over here. All right, but that was a nice beginning. Oh, we've got four down here and there and a four across there as well. So we get one more easy number there. All right, look, we've got a couple of blocks with e uh, empty bits here. Let's see what goes here. We're looking for one, three, nine. We got one and three there. One, three, nine. How about over here? Uh, we are looking for three, six, eight in those squares there. Nope. Okay, so what are we looking for? So we got three, six, eight. So, oh, and this was what? Ah, we can. No, let's do this. This was one, three, nine. Actually, let's just go up here. One, three, nine. Uh, what are we left with? One, three, nine. One, three, nine. So, four, five, six, seven. I think so. Sevens up there. Four, five, six, seven. Ah, oh, wait a minute, we've got nine down here, nine across there, and nine is one of those squares blocking up. That's the nine, isn't it? And then one is in one one is in one of those squares and one blocking down here, one up there, that's got to be a one. Uh, 
Okay, I'm, memory's not holding on very long here. <laughs> uh, three, six, eight, is it? Three, six, eight, and so this is, so when the four block's there, that's gonna be the four, and that's not three, six, or eight, so it is five. Right, up here then, we're looking for three, four, five, I think. Three, four, five, yeah. Three, four, five, and this is going to be six and seven. <coughs> Let's wander around first. So two five down here is a pair, two and five, two and five. That's going to put two and five into those squares there. Now we've got eight blocking across here and eight down here. That's going to give me and the eight in those squares there. So this is two and five. So we'll be left with one, four, six, seven. A pair of fours there. Sevens there. No, it can't be one. That's not right, is it? Sorry. Uh, four and seven. That's true. Six. Uh, anywhere four six seven what's the other number uh, this was two and five nine oh okay we've got nines so we've got nine blocking down here and down here so that's going to be a nine two five one six uh, I did it again uh, uh, um, six seven four six four and seven block this square that's going to give okay we've got four across here four down here that's the four we've got seven across here there's the seven and this would be a six Ugh. all right <laughs> finally Uh, I see five and seven blocking this square and I don't see five or seven in this column so that means that has to be five and seven and this has to be three uh, three blocking up here up here and across there there's a three three across this way this way there's a three
Uh, am I missing three, six, seven, eight across the middle here? Three, six, seven, eight. Three, six, seven, eight. I think I am. So three, seven, and eight. I'll block that square there. So that's a six. Doesn't seem to help me much though. Or maybe. Okay, so uh, I've I've missed something pretty obvious here. Five blocks this square here, right? So five must be in one of these two squares, and we know that five can only be in one of these two squares here. So that must be five, and that must be seven. 7 across there, 7 up there, and there's the 7. 7 back this way, 7 across there, there is our 7. And 7 down here, 7 across there, there is 7. 7 down and down and across there, there is 7. 7 this way and this way puts 7 into that square there. And what are we left with? Oh, seven is finished. Uh, we've got what's missing up here? This was can't remember now. Four, five. So this is going to be six. eight blocks this square here in this row that must be eight this has to be a three three blocking across here that gives me three in that square there last number there is six six across there gives me a six in that square there six up six across there there's a six six down and down there means that's six and six across here and across there should finish off the sixes. Does. I think we'll um, maybe we'll just click on what we still need, see if there's anything. Yeah, we got the one blocking across here, so one in one of those squares, so that can't be a one. That has to be a one. Then we can get this number here, which is nine. And over here we can add uh, an eight. Uh, right back to the ones again. Oh, there's something missing up the top here, isn't there? Um, what's missing from here? Uh, is it nine? I think it's nine, isn't it? We've also got nine blocking down there. It gives me nine there. Nine across there and there makes that nine. Uh, now what? Not much more to do. Uh, one across here will give me one in that square and the last number to place here is a three still need a three for this row um one number left for this row that looks to be a one and the last number down here is eight eight blocking up there and across there there's an eight and one in that square there last number there five five across there there's five this will be four Four across here and up there there's four one across there there's the one missing number here two two blocking down there's two missing number there five five blocking up there's five and this would be a one so that's our New York Times hard level stoker puzzle out of the way for Thursday thank you for joining me take care bye bye